The Senior Bowl is going down this week, signaling the official start of off-season shenanigans and, and whatnot. And beyond uh, all the draft prospects and, and, and stuff, all of the NFL executives, or for the most part, executives, scouts, coaches, are all gathering down in Mobile. They're going to Veets for uh, for uh, a, a couple of bud, bud lattes. Uh, and this is how business gets done uh, in the National Football League. And I love just like speculation season. It, it's fantastic. So our guy, Matt Anderson uh, of Vikings Wire and Daily Norseman, uh, he, down in Mobile doing some great coverage. Give him a follow. Uh, he, he he got a shot. That's right. Investigative journalism. Uh, Vikings GM Quasi Dofa Mensa here in Mobile at, at Senior Bowl talking with Steelers Brian Flores, who's a candidate for D.C. here in Minnesota. That's right. So zoom in and enhance. So you got Quasi. By the way, you forget how tall Quasi is. Like Quasi's... 6'4", if he's an inch, like 6'4", 6'5". I mean, Flores played safety at Boston College back in the day. Uh, so he, he's, uh, I think he was listed at 6'1", 6'2". And so Quasey's certainly up there. Now, is this proof that the Vikings are fully in on Brian Flores? No, but it's kind of fun. Also, I don't know who the Droni is in the foreground. But we'll see. Obviously, he and Quasey are uh, engaged in conversation. You know, Quasey's having a chuckle. Who, who really knows? But I, I think, uh, of course, at this point of the offseason, it is super interesting. And, you know, the question is, why has the Vikings defensive coordinator search dragged on for so long? How come there hasn't been any reports of second interviews? How come there hasn't been additional names beyond the, the cur- four current candidates? Ryan Nielsen, of course, took the Falcons job. Mike Pettin in-house just chilling. Sean Desai uh, is out there. And then I I do think that Flores is the number one target as of right now, but he's still in the running for the Cardinals job. And also with Sean Payton, stupid ass Sean Payton. Sorry, we always have to add that in. uh, Taking over the Broncos gig, uh, probably going to bring him in his own defensive coordinator. Oh, by the way, so conspiracy theory time. So a bunch of reports have been out that, and even Dion said that Zimmer is going to join him in Colorado. He was uh, like an analyst or whatever uh, at Jackson State with uh, primetime last season. But, but it hasn't been confirmed, and Zimmer's daughter's even refuted that he's going to Colorado uh, as of right now. So I think that there's a chance that given their connection in Dallas, you know, Sean Payton and Mike Zimmer, they're boys from back in the day. I think that Zim might actually be in Colorado, but be DC of the Broncos. Woo! That's right, man. That, that's right. But anyways, long story longer, Zimmer gets a D.C. job with the Broncos. Uh, Jero Vero, uh, who has ties with Kevin O'Connell from the Rams days, maybe he is added to this interview list. Who, who really knows? But as of right now, I, I still think that the number one candidate is Brian Flores. And I, I know that people are saying, it's like, oh, why would you want a defensive coordinator who's just going to leave for a head coaching job? That's what you want. Like, Do you want a defensive coordinator or just a, a coordinator in general who is so – either incompetent or inert at their job and lack of uh, charisma where they're not in demand for a head coaching job because that's what happens. I mean, it's an imperfect hiring structure, but coordinators who do well at their job and do well in in their interview and are clear leaders of men, like obviously they're going to be up for head coaching jobs. So yes, I I do want Brian Flores. Yes, I I think that he would be a great counterbalance, a little bit of yin and yang uh, to uh, Kevin O'Connell's player coach, uh, you know, being a player's coach perspective because Brian Flores, by all accounts, a bit of a hard ass, but maybe that's what they need on that defense as they tear it uh, down and rebuild it. So whatever. But uh, who knows what's going to happen? Maybe Flores gets the Cardinals job. Maybe he doesn't. Uh, but if Arizona goes in a different direction, I would love, I would love Brian Flores to be defense coordinator of the Vikings and Quasi just say, hey, 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 buddy. Um, how many millions do you need? Like just make him the highest paid defense coordinator. I don't care. I, I do not care. There's no salary cap on assistance. So we go from there. But uh, your thoughts are thoughts. Quasey and Brian Flores spot together in Mobile at the Senior Bowl. Speculation time. Let us know your thoughts and our thoughts in the comment section below. Subscribe for daily Vikings takes. Want to support the work? Put a little something in the Venmo. But to next time, Skull Production Value.